welcome to my channel so in this video we are going to see the problems uh, related to the series rlc circuit okay uh, so these problems are very important problems so you see the same problem it is uh, as green december 2017 and uh, now may 2019 and december 2012 and every year this in may 2008 okay so every year in the from this topic uh, uh, there are some problems it will come okay so so we are going to see the problem related to this series rlc circuit okay so the first question compute the q of series rlc circuit with r equal to 10 l equal to 0.04 henry and c equal to 1 farad find the bandwidth and resonant frequency and half power frequency okay so these are all the things so in this uh, uh, you see so q means you know quality factor okay so series rlc circuit first you know okay what is series rlc circuit so in this the resistor inductor and capacitor is connected in series combination with some input voltage okay so that is said to be the series rlc circuit and you know this rlc circuit uh, it is a resonant circuit okay resonant circuit so before this rlc circuit the resistor value inductor value and capacitor value is given so what is the question means a compute q okay what is q quality factor okay quality factor of that particular rlc circuit we have to calculate and also calculate bandwidth okay so what is the bandwidth of the series rlc circuit resonant frequency and half power frequency we are going to calculate so this is its mark question so this type of problem it's a important problem okay so first one we are going to write the given data okay so what are the given data resistor r equal to 10 ohm l equal to 0.04 henry c equal to 1 farad okay so the first thing uh, in order to calculate the quality factor first we should know the resonant frequency okay so that's why first one we are calculating the resonant frequency okay so the resonant frequency uh, it may be in two thing that is uh, omega not r f not that is the omega not is said to be the resonant frequency in radians the f not is said to be resonant frequency in hertz okay so here we are calculating the resonant frequency omega not so what is the resonant frequency of the series rlc circuit so whose formula is 1 divided by square root of l into c okay so you just uh, substitute the value of l and c upon 1 divided by square root of what is the value of l 0.04 and what is the value of c it's a 1 farad okay so one farad so you just substitute and find out the answer the omega not is 5 radians okay so resonant frequency we calculated okay next one we are going to calculate the quality factor q okay so this is the formula in order to find the quality factor of series rlc circuit okay so there are three formulas are there in order to find the quality factor three formulas are there so we may use any formula so what are the formula means the first one is omega not l divided by r okay the another one is 1 divided by omega not c r or otherwise 1 by r square root of l c so we may use any any one of the formula in order to calculate this quality factor in any method we will get the same answer okay so the quality factor of this series rlc circuit is omega not l divided by r okay so we have to substitute the values what is omega not so from the previous step omega not we calculated as 5 and the l value is 0.04 and r value is 10 okay so you just substitute and you have to find out the answer the quality factor is 0.02 so what is the unit for the quality factor quality factor it is said to be the just number okay no unit so that's why uh, the quality factor we calculated is 0.02 okay this is the thing and the next one uh, bandwidth of the circuit we have to calculate so the bandwidth of the uh, given circuit is calculated as uh, the bandwidth is equal to r divided by 2 pi l okay so this is the bandwidth formula in hertz okay so if we want to find out the bandwidth in radians means so you just uh, uh, that multiply this hertz with 2 pi so that's why we will get the formula r divided by l okay so this is the r by 2 pi l is the bandwidth formula in hertz okay so the same bandwidth in order to find out in radians means the formula is r divided by l okay so so first we calculated in hertz also in radians also okay so in problem uh, in some problem they are mentioning it as find bandwidth resonant frequency in hertz they will ask but here uh, just find bandwidth resonant frequency so we may calculate 
either hertz value or radiance value okay that's why we calculated both the values okay so the bandwidth is equal to r divided by 2 pi l so we just substitute the value r is 10 l is 0.04 so we calculated the bandwidth is 39.78 hertz okay so this is the bandwidth in hertz so if you want to find out the bandwidth in radians means you just multiply this hertz answer with 2 pi or otherwise you use the formula what is the formula this r by 2l okay instead of this 1 by 2 pi this simply r divided by l okay so we, we are calculating the answer is 250 radians okay this is the bandwidth okay so next one uh, the question is half power frequency okay so what does it mean by half power frequency that is in the series rlc circuit in two frequencies the frequencies at which the series rlc circuit the power at the series rlc circuit reaches half of the maximum power okay that's why that the two frequencies are said to be half power frequency okay so there are two uh, cut off frequency is there one is lower cut off frequency another one is a upper cut off frequency okay so what is the lower cut off frequency formula mean the lower cut off frequency equal to 1 divided by 2 pi into minus r by 2l plus 1 by 2 square root of r squared by l squared plus 4 divided by lc okay so this is the standard formula in order to find out the lower cut off frequency of series rlc circuit okay so the higher cut off frequency is that uh, 1 by 2 pi r by 2l plus the same value okay so what is the difference between this lower cut off frequency and upper cut off frequency means so here one minus it will come okay in lower cut off frequency in upper cut off frequency this is not a minus it is a plus okay so that is the only difference between the lower and upper cut off frequencies okay so if you just substitute the value of r l and c values so if you are substituting and if you are calculating in calci means we will get the answer is the lower cut off frequency equal to 0. 0.15756 hertz okay so it is nearly 0 hertz the lower cut off frequency is so you see this is the 0.015 hertz so it is a nearly uh, it is a 0 uh, hertz okay then we calculated the upper cut off frequency so what is the difference so in this formula here in lower cut off frequency here one minus will come here for plus will come okay remaining at all the same formula so you just substitute and if you are calculating the answer is 39.5 805 hertz okay so this higher cut off frequency we calculated and the lower cut off frequency we calculated okay and th this bandwidth you know what is mean by bandwidth means the bandwidth is said to be the difference between this higher cut off frequency and this lower cut off frequency so by you just subtract uh, 39.805 minus of 0.0157 means we will get the same answer 39.78 hertz okay so that is also yeah another one method in order to find out the bandwidth okay instead of using this formula in order to find out the bandwidth we have to calculate upper cut off frequency and the lower cut off frequency if you are subtracting that two frequency means we will get the bandwidth also okay that is another one method so by in this way we have to calculate the uh, uh, calculate the answers for these thing okay so what is the what is the resonant frequency formula resonant frequency formula is 1 by square root of lc okay so you just remember and the quality factor what is the formula omega not l by r what is the bandwidth formula in hertz means r by 2 pi l in radians means simply r divided by l and the lower and upper cut off frequency is 1 divided by 2 pi into minus r by 2l plus 1 by 2 square root of r squared by l squared plus 4 by lc in upper cut off frequency instead of this minus uh, in that case plus will come okay so it is a upper cut off and a lower cut off frequency in hertz okay so these are all the thing so it's a important question okay but similarly uh, here you see one two more problem uh, a series rlc circuit has r equal to 1 kilo ohm l equal to 1 milli henry and c equal to 1 pico farad find the quality factor of the load okay so it is a may 2019 question okay so in a series rlc circuit always problem will come either in 2 mark or 8 mark okay 8 mark question okay that is a simply resonant frequency or they will ask resonant frequency or quality factor or something they will ask okay so in this thing r l c value is given so the question is only we have to calculate the quality factor okay 
So already you know the quality factor formula. What is the quality factor formula? Omega naught L by R. Okay, in order to find out this quality factor, first we have to calculate the value of omega naught. Okay. So what is omega naught? Omega naught is a resonant frequency in radians. So what is the formula for omega naught? One divided by square root of L into C. Okay. So you sub just substitute the value of L and C. Okay. If you are calculating the omega naught value is thirty one point six into ten to the power six radians. Okay. This is the omega naught value. Okay. And substitute this omega naught value in quality factor. Okay. Okay. In quality factor, the omega naught is thirty one point six two into ten to the power six. L value is one milli. So milli means you know milli means ten to the power minus three. Okay. Then pico. Pico means ten to the power. Ah, uh, the pico means ten to the power minus twelve. Okay. So here R value. What is R? One kilo ohm. So one kilo. Kilo means ten to the power plus three. Okay. So you just substitute the values and find out the answer. Means we will get thirty one point six two. Okay, this is the one. So this is a one way of calculating the quality factor. Okay. So instead of these two thing, we may calculate the quality factor using another one formula. Okay. So already I told uh, that is uh, uh, the quality factor. In order to calculate the quality factor, three formulas are there. One is omega naught L by R. Another one is one divided by omega naught C R. The third formula is one by R square root of L C. Okay. So in this all resistor, inductor, and capacitor values available, no omega naught is available. Okay. So but you may choose in order to calculate the quality factor. Uh, in this problem, R L C. Okay. Three values are given. So by using this direct formula, you may calculate the answer. Okay. So by you substitute the value of R L C, we will get the same answer, thirty one point six two. Okay. So if we are using any uh, that is any correct uh, uh, equation, we may get the same answer. Okay, so it is also a yeah, important problem. Okay, this is a two mark question. And the third one, uh, you see, a series RLC circuit consists of 50 ohm resistance, 0.2 Henry inductance, and 100 microfarad capacitance with the applied voltage of 20 volt. Okay, determine. The resonant frequency, quality factor, lower and upper cutoff frequency, and bandwidth of the circuit. Okay, so similar to the first problem. So here for different data, uh, they may ask the thing. Okay, so by in series RLC circuit, 50 ohm resistance. What is this 50 ohm? It's a value of R. Okay, the first one you have to write the given data. R is 50 ohms. Okay, and the inductance is 0.2 Henry. Apa L equal to 0.2 Henry. And the capacitor C equal to 100 microfarad. So the capacitor C equal to 100 microfarad. Okay, and the applied voltage is 20 volt. So the applied voltage V equal to 20 volt. Okay, so these are all the given data. So by using these data, we are going to calculate the four things. One is resonant frequency, quality factor. Lower and upper cutoff frequency bandwidth. Okay, so already you know the formula in order to calculate these things. Okay, so what is the first one? Uh, the resonant frequency omega naught is one divided by square root of L C. Okay, but here the L is point two. What is the value of C? Hundred microfarad. Okay, so micro means uh, you know ten to the power minus six. But ten into ten to the power minus six, you just substitute and find out the answer. So it is a seven not seven point one radians. Okay, so this is the resonant frequency in radians. Okay, if we want to calculate the resonant frequency in hertz, means this omega naught divided by two pi, or you may use f naught equal to one by two pi root L C. Okay, so if the omega naught divided by two pi, we will get one one two point five three hertz. Okay, this is the resonant frequency in hertz. This is the resonant frequency in radians. Then the next one is we have to calculate the quality factor. So you know the formula for the quality factor. Okay, there are three formula is there. One is omega naught L by R. Another one is one by omega naught R into C. Another one is one by R into square root of L C. So we may use any one formula in order to find out the quality factor. So by here I am using the first formula omega naught L by R. So what is the value of omega naught? We calculated as seven or seven point one. And what is the value of L? It is 0.2 divided by what is the value of R? It is 50. So you just substitute and find out the answer. It's a 2.82. Okay. So already you know the quality factor has no unit. It is a just number. 
okay so quality factor is derived okay then the bandwidth we have to calculate so in order to calculate the bandwidth already um, uh, already i told that is a, uh, in order to find out the bandwidth we may use the formula or it is a difference between upper cut off frequency and lower cut off frequency so we may use any method okay so when this the bandwidth is said to be what is the formula for the bandwidth r divided by 2 pi l so substitute the value of r and l so we will get the answer 39.78 hertz okay this is the bandwidth in hertz formula okay so then we have to calculate lower and upper cut off frequency so the lower cut off frequency okay formula you know what is the formula 1 by 2 pi minus r by 2l plus 1 by 2 into square root of r squared by l squared plus 4 by lc okay so the upper cut off frequency is 1 by 2 pi the same formula instead of this minus we have to put plus okay so when this uh, uh, we calculated the fl is equal to 94.39 hertz and the upper cut off frequency is 134.178 hertz okay so if you are subtracting these uh, two thing means we will get this answer okay that is also yeah, another one method in order to find out the bandwidth okay so this is a one uh, same similar type of problem with different data okay and the third one so here it is a 2018 question so this question is somewhat different okay since the given data is different okay so in the previous two uh, in the previous three problem the value of r l c is given and uh, uh, the question is to find out the resonant frequency uh, bandwidth then quality factor what is the lower and upper cut off frequencies okay but here Uh, there are two only two data are given so what are the given data you just see quality factor is given so quality factor equal to 250 given uh, and at the resonant frequency is given resonant frequency is 1.5 mhz okay so here the given data is different okay so by using these two data how to find out the bandwidth and its half power frequency okay so it is a somewhat different problem okay so you see for, uh, so first one we have to write the given data so what are the given data two data given one is the quality factor what is quality factor the quality factor is given as 250 okay uh, resonance at 1.5 mhz so what is this 1.5 mhz it is a uh, resonant frequency formula okay this is the resonant frequency given in hertz apa hertz means it is a f not not omega not okay so it is a important thing so here the frequency is given in radians means it is omega not but here the frequency is given in hertz so it is said to be the f not so f not equal to 1.5 mhz so these are all the two data so what is our question our question is to find the bandwidth and half power frequencies okay so the first one so we have to calculate the bandwidth so already we know that the relation between quality factor uh, then this resonant frequency and bandwidth so this is the formula now this is the relation between quality factor resonant frequency and bandwidth so the quality factor equal to resonant frequency divided by bandwidth so from this quality factor value you know f not you know apa we may rearrange this equation in order to find out the bandwidth but from this the bandwidth can be written as f not divided by q not and f not is 1.5 mhz so meha means 10 to the power 6 divided by the quality factor it is 250 So by you just substitute the value and find out the answer. So the bandwidth is six thousand hertz. Okay. So here the F not is in hertz. So that's why we will calculate the bandwidth is also in hertz. So six uh, thousand means uh, so we will write in engineering term. Six uh, thousand means it is a six kilohertz. Okay. So bandwidth we calculated. Okay. And the next one here the question is we have to find the half power frequencies. Okay. So what is half power frequency? There are two half power frequencies. One is the lower cut off frequency. Another one is the upper cut off frequency. F L and F H. F L means lower cut off frequency. F H means upper cut off frequency. So this is the formula for lower cut off and upper cut off. So the difference between these two formula is here minus here plus. Okay, except this one, the same answer. This is the lower and upper cut off frequency. So, in order to find out uh, this lower and upper cut off frequency, we should know the value of resistor, inductor, and capacitor. Okay, but in this problem, so there is no value of R, L, and C. Okay, so only we are knowing the value of quality factor and the resonant frequency. 
but from this given data so we have to uh, we have to find out something and we have to substitute in this formula okay so over here uh, the value of rlc okay how to calculate the value of rlc means you, you just see so here you know the formula for the quality factor what is the formula for the quality factor omega not l by r okay by instead of this omega not we may put omega not is necessary to be 2 pi f not into l by r okay aba here you know quality factor you know and f not is you know correct aba from this substituting the value of q value and f not value l and r is unknown okay so you substitute the given data and rearrange the equation and find out the value of r divided by l okay but from this the r divided by l is calculated as 37700 okay so you take uh, this is some equation okay this is the ratio this 37700 is a ratio of resistor by inductor okay this is the one thing and another one uh, you know the resonant frequency formula so the resonant frequency in hertz that is f not formula is 1 by 2 pi root lc okay 1 by 2 pi root lc but from this f not you know but you don't know the value of this l and c okay so that's why here you just uh, give this root lc in left side and f not to the right side so root of lc equal to 1 by 2 pi f not okay so taking square on both side so we will get lc equal to 1 divided by 2 pi f not the whole square so but from this the 1 divided by lc value we calculated as some value it is a 8.82 into 10 to the power 13 okay so 1 divided by lc value we calculated appa you see uh, you see the formula for fl and fh appa in this formula for fl and fh there is a term r by l is there okay you see r by l here also r by l is there and here 1 divided by lc term is there okay appa uh, in order to that is uh, using this uh, quality factor formula and f not formula so we derived the ratio r by l as well as this 1 by lc okay so but directly we have to substitute the value of this r by l and this 1 by lc in this lower cut off frequency and upper cut off frequency we will calculate the answers okay if you see fl equal to 1 by 2 by this is the formula if instead of this uh, r divided by l okay instead of this r divided by l we have to put the value as 37700 okay so here and here similarly instead of this 1 divided by lc we have to put 8.82 into 10 to the power 13 by here uh, substituting and if you are calculating the answer means uh, we will get the lower cut off frequency is 1.4969 mhz okay this is the thing similarly the fh value calculated as 1.5029 mhz okay always the upper cut off frequency is greater than the lower cut off frequency okay so by in this method we have to uh, calculate this problem okay so this is somewhat different problem okay so in the first three problem r l c value directly given so but directly we substitute in quality factor bandwidth and uh, half power frequencies but in this problem in may 2018 in this problem quality factor and resonant frequency is given okay by using these two value we have to find out the value of two thing okay what is the thing r by l and 1 by lc okay so how we are calculating this ratio r by l means we have to write on the q formula so in this q formula uh, this q and f not given so you substitute uh, you just rearrange and find out the value of r by l similarly in f not equal to 1 by 2 pi root lc formula you know apa from this you just substitute the rearrange and find out the value of 1 by lc okay and these two ratio if you are substituting in fl and f such means we will get these answers okay so these are all the uh, problems related with the series rlc circuit okay so these are all the very important problems it's a repeated problem okay every time these type of questions uh, they will ask okay so you just learn okay thank you Thank you for watching